Talk Shows TV. Uh, I'm not sure kung siya nga rin ang gagamit talaga nitong Farsa. We can expect maybe Farsa Kerry, Marksman Farsa, Farsa Tank, di ba? So, <laughs> knowing how creative Chokes is, hindi ganun ka imposible na unahin niya tong Farsa, tapos iwan niya nalang Odette for last pick possibly. At ito na nga, kinuha nila si Barats. Ay, At five. Ay. Also a fighter, I think. Or no, tank Ay, ba, Leo, nakakatakot hmm. tong burst damage na pwedeng iba to ng Team Chokes kasi Farsa... Yes. At Odette, that's a lot of ano, area, uh, area damage na yep. pwedeng saluhin dito ng fighter na nasa side ng uh, Team Doggy kung saan early game time, syempre, usually hindi ka naman magbibuild pa ng uh, magic defense item at unless yun talaga yung gagawin na nila early on, no? like, sasacrifice nila yung damage mm -hmm. uh, para makakuha agad ng magic defense kasi for sure, may hirapan sila dito if they will have two burst mage damage coming from the Farsa and Odette. Yep, yep, sobrang linis nung kailangan gawin dito ng Team Chokes. But we're going into the second phase of banning now and ayun na naman si Nadogs. I, I really am finding it hard to comprehend. Kasi si Chokes, for sure, he's a mad genius. Baliw-baliw ginagawa ni Chokes. Tank Layla to start. Let's, let's not go from there. But why is Doggy banning more heroes na pwede nilang gamitin? I don't know, YZ already and Khalid. Those are like super duper high priority fighters right now. I don't know. I'm guessing isa lang naman kasi ang kailangan na lang eh. Isa lang ang pwede gamitin ni Chokes dito, which is the Blank Hero plus Odette. So, I don't know. Sobrang nagtataka ako sa ginagawa ni Dogs. Ang daming options, diba? Ang daming options. We still have Cho available. Thumbs is there too. Ang dami pang okay na hero. So I guess what Doggy is trying to do in here is to just limit all the other heroes na pwedeng piliin pa nitong Team Chooks. But yeah, you were taking a look at that one, Selena. And ayun, binanggit natin. Okay, pinag-iisipan pa nila between Guinevere. Ang dami, ang dami choices, di ba? Right? Mm-hmm. Yung Guinevere maganda rin. Parang they're doubling down on the laning limit. Tipong nasa mid lang tayo eh. So, andaling magbato ng arrow, andaling magbato ng hook. And now they're thinking... Pwede rin ba tayo magpasok ng sobrang lupit na Violet Requiem? Pero parang hindi mo rin kailangan eh. Kasi meron ka ng King's Calling, meron ka ng Last Insanity. Pero okay din yung Bane. Parang okay, maganda rin yung Bane. Eh. Yeah. Ako, eh. Tapusin okay. nyo na through mid. You can push oh. super hard. Pero, hmm, I'm wondering why they heroes... They CC. Yeah. I think like, they want more CC in here. Kasi ayang inisip ko. In terms of damage, what do you think? Where That's what I'm gonna say. Towards to? Parang kulang yung damage dito ni na... Dogs. I was thinking yeah. a hero like Hanabi would just super duper dominate. Di ba isang lane na nga lang kayo mag-aasama pa kayo eh. So yung uh, yung cleave, di ba? Yung cleave ng range attack ni Hanabi plus uh, Higanbana, I think that would have really uh, pushed it over the limit. But oh well. Imagine stuns connecting to all other heroes, di ba? Oh, yes. But Pero, uh, no one went in for a marksman. But uh -oh. yeah, let's leave it be. You know, Ganito yan. <laughs> oh, feeling ko kasi masyadong madali kapag naghanabi. Masyadong madali kapag ginamit nila yung mga inisip natin. So that's why sabi ni Dogs, the ultimate flex, di ba? Uy, trash talk yun ah. Binan nila yung malalakas na fighter. Binan nila yung Yujong. Binan nila yung Khalid. Sabi na kaya namin, ito lang. Okay? So for the most part, a lot of these heroes are off the meta. But again, I think we agree. Damage-wise lamang ang Team Chokes. Sa CC naman, and I think their engagements para lamang yung boss yung uh, yung yung lineup ni boss dogs so with that being said isaya who do you think is going to be taking game 1 mid lane mania i think i'm going to go to where the damage is do na ko sa team troops kasi early game time if they get a lot of kills already probably kaya nila mag snowball from there for as long as nandiyan yung protection and may meron din namang stun dito si Odette so pag nag-connect yon pati yung kay Johnson go for it tayo diyan so i think i'm going to go for team chokes okay well okay dogs ako kasi kahit sabi mo talo yan at least nag-flex sila all right at least they tried and they became flashy with it here we go it's not to fire on that franco and they are looking for angles. I guess, pwede ko makakita dito. Masakit pa rin pala yung Johnson. Kasi meron din siyang range, meron siyang poke. Yeah, yeah. He can oh. poke out, you know, uh, players. Pero yan, yeah, makikita natin dito. Yung iba nag-jungle. Si Inzai plays. He took advantage of this rule kung saan pwedeng mag-jungle. So why not? Hindi pa naman siya kailangan doon. And given that... Oh, by, by the way, apat pala. Tatlo pala. Actually, wait. We have a lot of magic 
damage pala dito para sa side ng Ejo. Even mm -hmm. worse uh, the uh, uh, inside place. Magic damage yep. ang out niya. Magic and physical yan si Karina. Yeah, as a as a as an assassin. So uh, parang yung yung lineup ni Chooks, it parang kabalik taran siya ng personality ni Chooks. Kabalik taran siya ng stream ni Chooks na may ginagawang kababalaghan. This is super simple. This is super efficient. As in gusto lang nila lumaban via the initiation of uh, the Odep or via Kayla's um, feathered airstrike. So parang ha, huh, simple lang. I think ang ang strength lang ng team ni Doggy dito is they can choose where to fight kasi nga sila yung lamang sa CC they're the ones who can do the pickoffs pero ang tagal ang hirap this is such a oh! but nice hook! oh nice hook! oh si Lario TV the first got pa ka dito ni Doggy hindi na nga nakawala pero tamang bangkawi din naman dito one for one three so far but they have to back out pero sa kami ng inside no I'm gonna try to get a more damage against yung kamuntikan pa rin dito si Kbeer so mamba out muna yun ako kit na emoticon yakayak muna tayo sa gilid balik sa base regenerate ng konti HP pero ang ganda one for one trade agad Dio oh no Mr. Hawkwit I flicker out by Lebron here's what's interesting kay Zaya no iniisip lang natin yung interaction of skills pero hold up okay I think merong pumuntang side lane there you go alright let's enforce the rules Kuya Payne, El Capitan, bawal tayo sa side lanes. Oh, okay, so, here's, lang, oh, oh, oh. Here's, the, uh, here's the interesting point kay Saya. Sipin mo, lahat sila naghahati-hati sa EXP dyan sa mid. Correct. Right? So, so, heroes have to die. Para lang magka, magka, makakita tayo ng mga ult. Kasi siya mo, usually 2 two, two minutes, right? 2 minutes, 3 minutes. Dapat may level 4 na dyan eh. Dapat yung dalawang core, possibly level 4 na. But right now, karamihan sa kanila level 3, level 2. And it's because they're happy, happy sila sa resources. So I think more heroes need to die. And so far, one one palang. Yeah, but level four na yata dito yung isa sa members ng team ko na bet. Pero yung men sila wala ko sama sama sila sa mid. Pero tega lang kung may magmakala ng tayo dito na nagaganap. Oh, the coming up from the far side right now. Ang sakit. Sabi naman ng member dito ng team doggy natin. Pero wala naman na punish. So good pa rin naman yun. Pero balikan natin yung ginagawa ni Inzay dito. Iwalay siya ngayon sa mga katin niya. So 4v5 yung nangyayari sa mid. What do you think, Leo? Ano yung advantage pa dito na nagja-jungle si Inzay Blaze? Yes. Yes. Our earlier point. Hold up! Nagda-drive dito. Saktong landing. There's the feather there. Strike. Getting the stun. Down goes Doggy. May isa pa ba? Hinahabol si Natsupai and he gets away. Last in sanity dito. Umiigot-iigot na si Kuya. Oh, that's 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 Ate. That's that's Madame Blue. And there's a trade. One for one. Down goes Inzai. And we have a ball game. Okay, question. Lamang ba doon ang Team Chokes dahil nagja-jungle? Dedicated jungler in yeah, the place. I think so. I think yes. Because if there is a source of source of EXP and uh, gold in Zai, hindi siya tulad ni Pain na naikiagaw lang. Oh no, nice stun. Pero walang bato. Walang bato. Oh. Okay, kalao. Kalao magbiten ni. Grabe talaga dito. Pero yah, may maasim lang na place. Maasim place. Yung ginawa ni tungsi in Zai. Kanina nung Zai sa tier one turret. No, flicker out by Lebron. Okay, kay Saya, they're gonna go for the turtle here. Ito yung interesting, no? Ito yung inisip ko. Kung tuloy-tuloy ito, hindi na kaya bumawi ng chokes because, uh, ni na chokes because a lot of what they're trying to do start, uh, it goes off of their gimmicks. Di ba parang ang dami, combo eh, makombo yung team ni chokes eh. Pero yung team ni dogs, parang basta may pumasok na isang hook or isang arrow, merong sure na isang patay. Di ba? Oh, there it is. See, that's what I'm saying. Bagay the diving kalang yun, no? Kasi alam nilang malapot. Ang mahirap kasi dito ng implement sa side ng team chokes. Hindi po yung magkamali si Larion. Tulad ng kanina, di ba? Attempted to go for a stun. 
uh, while he's driving pero tumama mm-hmm. sa wall hindi yep. na connect yon na sayang and uh, that's uh, the moment na tinake advantage ng team doggy na sagupain itong team troops natin mm-hmm. kaya wala na sayang yeah, no? kaya kahit na nagtago na malambot pero si doggy dito yon na na well falling down with the camera from the old dead right now but they're they're too squishy to handle all the damage coming up to the members of Team Doggy right now. So Doggy Tito, Selena, Pukil pa nga. And I think the Tier 1 turret will fall down anytime soon if they have a minion wave. Uh, they have a few, but I guess it will be enough. It will be enough to take down this Tier 1 turret. Okay, so that's what I was saying, no? Parang ang kailangan lang gawin ni Dogs play well, play properly. Pero itong team ni Chokes, kailangan nila magawa yung combo. And Kayla, Kayla barely getting away. Na una pa bumagsak dito si Madam Lu. And what's interesting is, wala pa yatang glowing wand si Lu. So I guess if she did, Kayla would have gone down. And there you go again. I think Larion could do a little better with his Johnson driving. Pero okay na lang din. It's not over. First tier turn pala. Oh, there's a knock-up. There's the Violet Requiem. Tinulak pa loob. Kahit na magpwede ng airstrike. The fucking Scalding dropped in here by Eruption. That's a double for the big guy. Isa pa. Nagahanap, Doggy. Managing his health bar. Oh, pumasok dito si Inzai. Takes down Doggy. Eruption trying to stop him. And Inzai can only go so much. But hold up. Pumasok si Lu. Wants to put in some more. Throw with the stakes and the flames and okay, safe. Pero wala kang immortality. You might die. Lebron might take you down. Takbo! Down. Ito na nga. Ito na nga. Ito na nga. Pero again, the advantage or the winning condition for the side of Team Doggy ay yung CC nila. Uh, lahat sila dito may pag CC at least uh, for Team Chooks naman, ang asahan lang tal- talaga nila mainly is yung combo ng Odette and Johnson na hindi pwedeng magkamali. And many times we've seen that play. Parang isang beses pa lang natin nakita na gumana uh, during the early game time. So far, ladies and gentlemen, kung nakakalimutan natin, meron tayong ongoing poll, no? I-comment nyo na lang kung sino ang mananalo at kung sino ang MVP. And so far, meron na tayong choices. Lamang si Team Doggy dito. Pero kung naghahanap tayo ng MVP, medyo iba rin yata. Kasi si Inzai plays, he's going for the play. He's going for the run here. And he gets knocked up by Doggy. Violet Requiem sa isa, makakataas pa. Nakataas na ba? Buti pinalaya. Piling ko pinagbibigyan din itong uh, si Do- Doggy ngayon eh. Pero... Babalik na, oh, ayan. Naalalahanan, naalalahanan naman si Pain. Minsan talaga nagiinit eh, di ba? Kung, kung Selena ka ba naman na 4-0-7, tapos karamihan ng arrows mo, tumatama, hindi ka mga habol, di ba? So, it, it, it's hard. It's hard to... Uh, <laughs> oh, to, 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 to control yourself. And I guess, naintindihan natin oh, ngayon, yung, yung lead na meron ng uh, team ni Doggy. But let's look at Chokes TV's uh, squad here. Late game scaling, okay din ba? Pero wait lang, nahuli dito ni Larion. There's the full combo. Pero mo ang mabawi yan si Doggy. And Chooks gets away with it. Takas pa nga si Edgar dito. At eto, in dive plays daw. Sinasunod lahat ng slow at first damage. Uy, naka-survive pa nga yata. Pero I think isang membro, kung si Larion, okay. Um, uh, may buhay, but yun nga lang. Nasupay pala. Actually, pareho yung tank ng Chooks TV team natin ay babagsak. biglang nahuli na si Lebron nag ulti but it's gonna be too much hindi ka ayo protektahan ni Edgar ni paring Chooks and there's another Violet Requiem 
by Doggy. This I think interesting though. No? Tama eh. I think the, the the lineup on Chokes TV's team is really built that way. Parang kung wala silang kung hindi dalawa o tatlo mapatay nila sa isang combo ni Larion and Odette, hindi sila mananalo. But they take down Natsupai, take that Kuya. And here's another one, mababaw yan. There's a nice pull onto Inzai. Wala nang pop-up potential. There you go, Eruption dropping the King's Calling just to be safe. Walang the dash pa loob dito. And so far, 2 for 1 ang trade na yun. And make it a 3 for 1. Medyo delay. Down goes Larion. Very dito, providing vision si Doggy. Nagamit-gamit ang Gwenitir. Habang bato naman ang bato dito ng stun. As well as itong Uh, by the way, it looks parang kailangan ni Team Doggy na magdisiplina ng konti. Pero ayun, this is an opening. Larion missed his ult. Larion missed the barrage. The rampage. Nice pull here by Eruption. Nalapagan ang team stalling. But it's going to fail to save Larion. Oh, sorry. Fail to save K-Bear. Dahil napag-cover dito si K-Bear ng kanyang failed air strike. Pero 3 for 1 na nga nangyari. Down goes Eruption. Down goes Natsupai. Pero Lugi. Ano nangyayari kayo ni Dogs? Team Kasalanan eh. Feeling hindi kasalanan eh. Ni, ni, ni uh, Pain. Kasi, ay sorry, ni, na mga kampi ni Inzai. Kasi kung isang si Lina yan, na ready na ready, na G na G, in, wala, wala, wala mapag-figure sa'yo. Ayun lang ka this. Lebron goes down. Yep, ang ball na nasa uh, kamay ng team sa game. They need to make sure that uh, kung si Larion ay papasok, mabait lang nila. At kung magkamali si Larion, that's definitely at least a sure kill. Kung di maulit lang kanina, K-Bear will deal a lot of damage. Edgar will deal a lot of damage. Actually, nagkabaliktad. I thought Kayla was uh, the Odette, pero si Chooks pala yun. Now, there you go. A failed attempt. A pull. Another pull. There you go. Eruption goes in. Nagaharap tayo ng kiss calling. There it is. Kisaya. Tipong nasa gilagid sila, nasa borderline sila. Tipong yung sa badminton, yung yung shuttle cap na punta sa dun sa sa linya. Yun yun eh. Yun yung linya right there oh. Sinasabi nila, hindi jungle pa rin to. Jungle pa rin to. So yun ang nangyari. Pero papasok din si Larion. Ang si Jokes, nabawian si Togi lang ang mapagligtas ng dalawa dito dahil meron pa siyang ay hindi na cooldown. Na cooldown pero nabuhay pa si Lu. Okay. Si Pain lang nawala. Susunod din si Lu. Okay, that's it. I think you need to get out of here. Okay, Saya, note ko lang ha, kanina dun sa wipeout na ginawa nina ako si Doggy, delayed yung wipeout na yun, medyo matagal. Pero sa totoo lang, 
Kung di sumali si Doggy sa teamfight, kumuha siya ng buff. At ngayon, pababag sa akin dito, si Inzai. So tama yung sinabi ni Doggy kay Raph. Tama yung sinabi ni Doggy kay Raph. Hindi ako maglalaro. Kukuha lang ako ng buff. Synergy already, and uh, it's it's showing. Because many of the many times, lang kita natin si Johnson, si Larion together with Shoots, Odette, kung mapasok sila ng kahit hindi pa handa yung teammates nila. Ito tulad dito mga drive bullet. I think magkasama sila. Ayan naman hindi pa handa. Hindi sila sa teammates nila, but for the sake of players, nakuha nila si Natsu Pai. Pero kita natin kung kailan sila gamba. Ready ba sila? This is a 4v5 situation right now. Just in case. Ang tanong kaya ba ng Shoots? Habang patay si Natsupai. That's one less stop for the side of Ako si Dogi. Lag na pag-push pa dito si Natsupai TV. Pero given that, I think I give them the advantage to taking turrets and objectives. Dahil sila yung merong range heroes. Walang range heroes si Natsupai. And yan, nagde-defend na si Erap TV. So with that being said, oh, that's gonna be another down. Immortality pop here. Nagahanap. Ooh. Ooh. Down goes Larry. Oh, susunod na rin dito si Chooks. That's a three for none. Medyo kalat. Medyo kalat. Meron na tayo mga teamfights na nangyayari sa jungle camp natin right now. Malapit na sana sa bottom lane. Pero, well, wala. Napiga siya ni Karina doon. Ni Ingai Place. But, yeah, look at the pressure being put here by Lebron. Part of the map actually bawal din. Nag-aspan na rin tayo mag-labanan dito. Pero hindi pinapawalan. Tuloy yung bakbakan, 2v1. But in the middle lane, we have another fight on going din naman. You can see in the minimap, si Inzai is still trying his best to go for a defense. Pero ito yung tunay na laban. Ito yung tunay na laban. Lebron, 2v1. Natsupai and Eruption, magsama pa kayo. Di nyo ako kaya. And I think, Lebron, I think, yeah, you need to get out of there. It's against the rules. Yan. Yan. Sabi ni Natsupai, maduga daw. Take it easy. Alright, relax. Larion coming in here. Lumabas. Si Kayla. And they take it easy. Back out lang. Pero yun nga, nabutas na. Yun na, Doggy. Yun yung ginagawa nila. Kaya saya, binutas nila. So I think this is good. Kasi may pressure na sa mid. And that's where the fight should be in. But eto na nga. Makikita natin. Ito na ko. Oh! I think that he's gonna. There's, yep, there you go. That's the Aether main special. That's the Aether special. Ito na yon. Ito na nga si Doggy. At syempre, ang tatapos, ang mga minions pa rin. <laughs> ang mga minions, ang tatapos. Uy, oh. nakaisa pa. Ayun, okay. Na okay, this is too much. Dapat tinapos na nila, dogs. What is this? What is this? Dapat tapos na! Kung inatain nila yung base, tapos na! Pero mga pinapasarap lang ni na dogs! Pinapasarap lang ni na dogs! Nako, Chooks! Ito na yung chance nyo! Ito na ang chance. Galing sa... Galing sa Karina. I think he's... He's finding the right target. Ayaw siyempre nang... Hindi nga ito isang mga makukunat. I'm going to wait for the HP bar to drop down. And ito na kuha si Natsu pa ay dito. The waiver will fall down through. There's the gang of the... The members of Chooks TV trying to back away the Burusa Mapa. Si Doggy, ito nga ba ang comeback ng Chooks TV. Pero naka-triple kill. Si Pain dito, ang hirap habulin ni Pain. Ang hirap habulin ni Pain. Si Pain at Lou, tinatag team nila itong dalawa na tira. Inzai and Lebron. Hindi man lang naging Lebron and Kayla. Inzai and Lebron. Kanina nakatawa, no? Hindi ko alam kung talaga piniling gawin ni Natsu pa yun. Pero ang dami niya pwedeng targetin ng hook. Pero yung kapatid niya pa talaga, yung tank eh, sabi la, si Larry yun yung tinira niya, nung kanyang hook. But then again, that's okay, makes for a better story. And Lebron here, finally gonna go down. Uy! Ang laki na! There you go. Okay, grabe talaga yung get big passive dito ni Barats. And, we're gonna get him here. Okay. Real, yep, real effort there. Para lang pabagsakin ng isa. Oh, bawal push diff lang. But anyways, nandito na tayo eh. Yan na, boom! Uh, Larion, wala sa kasama dito, but he will go for the stun. We 
Is he Lou on your turret right now? No. Uh, boy, the Sakura, I think, uh... Legendary! Oh, Nakatama pa nga si Lou doon. Yung damage ni Pain! Ako, may MVP na ako, guys. Sino ba kinakomment yung MVP? Kasi, meron isang tamang sagot, eh. Pag tinignan natin yung stats, may isang tamang sagot, okay? Meron din isang tamang sagot para kung sinong panalo talaga dito sa round 1. Mid lane mania. And I believe it's just a matter of time. The minions are working it. And congratulations to Team Doggy for taking game number 1.